As the Cincinnati Bengals and Los Angeles Rams were taking the field to kick off Super Bowl 56, teams from Cal OES were also in their positions. From the state's Emergency Operations Center in Sacramento, which was activated and monitoring the game, all the way to inside SoFi Stadium here in Inglewood, 18 months of preparation have led to this. And so I'm going to actually be inside the stadium. There's a joint operations center, and so I'll probably be there. I'm planning to be at 0700. We have a briefing for a, three, for a 1530 kickoff. These are what you live for because you plan, you plan, and now this is game day for us too. I will be in SoFi Stadium. I will be the only Cal OES Law Branch member in the stadium. I will be in the Public Safety Operations Center. So I will be right next to the Inglewood Police Department Incident Commander, uh, the gentleman who is the commander of the event. And we will be, I will be tracking in real time things that, as they come up and helping with solutions and monitoring what they are doing to address any issues that pop up. I will be in the LA, Los Angeles County Emergency Operations Center. So I will be communicating with our partners here at the JOC, um, with Law and Fire, with our region management, and of course with the SOC and the State Threat Assessment Center. I'll be um, acting as the Cal OES uh, communications unit leader here in the uh, communications room. Um, so pretty much just a point of contact um, on the communication side for OES in the event that any other entities or responding agencies, partners um, need assistance from Cal OES. I'm in one centralized spot to be able to kind of assist. The collaboration has been excellent. Uh, Inglewood Police Department is the lead agency, has done a phenomenal job. Um, planning and coordinating this and bringing all the federal, state, and local partners together. I'm actually I'm a Raiders fan, but uh, <laughs> since the Raiders aren't here, uh, my wife says I need to make sure the home team wins. To see more from Cal OES, visit our website at news.caloes.ca.gov.